Hello friends, we are going to draw a flow chart to calculate sum and average of given n numbers. n is the range. So I am starting the flow chart. Next, I am obtaining the range. input n from the user I am utilizing i equal to 0 sum equal to 0 and a variable to calculate average equal to 0. Now I am checking if if i less than n if i less than n if it is true if it is true means i am obtaining obtaining the numbers one by one input x so x is n is the range here x is the input if i know n equal to 3 0 less than 3 so it will obtain first input x next next i am adding sum equal to sum plus x So next I am incrementing i i equal to i plus 1 i equal to i plus 1 now I am connecting the flow back in the comparison station statement ok so it will first i is 0 if i give 2 means 0 less than 2 in plus obtain the value of an input x it means number and it will add the number in the variable sum and it can increment the i so until i less than 0 okay the loop will continuously obtain the input and add it in the sum if i less than n is false means if it is false no means. So what I am doing? I am calculating average. Average equal to sum divided by n. So the sum value divided by the range n. And I am printing the result. print sum comma average I'm printing sum and average and this is the logical end of the flowchart so here okay I am obtaining the range so here I am obtaining the range here next I am utilizing i equal to 0, sum equal to 0, average equal to 0 until i less than n, uh, obtaining input okay, from the user continuously 
input as I am adding in the variable sum and incrementing the variable i. Again, i less than n, it will obtain the next input and add it to the existing value of sum plus x and i will get incremented. So, until i less than n, we are continuously getting input and adding in the variable sum. Once i less than n is false means, no means, we are calculating average equal to sum by n. I am printing the result and this is the logical end of the flowchart. We will see how this flowchart works. We will go to walk through. So, logical start input n. I am giving n equal to 3. Okay. Here, i equal to 0. Equal to 0. Sum equal to 0. Average equal to 0. So, here I am checking i less than n, 0 less than 3 is true. I am obtaining input x, so my x value is 10, sum equal to sum plus x. So, what is the existing value of sum is 0, so sum equal to 0 plus 10, now the value of sum equal to 10. Next, I am incrementing i by 1, i equal to i plus 1, 0 plus 1, existing value of i is 0, 0 plus 1 equal to 1. Okay. I am checking now, see, I am checking the condition again. It's looping 1 less than 3. This is true. I am obtaining input x. Now I am giving 20. x equal to 20. Sum equal to sum plus x. Sum equal to, what is this value of sum? 10 plus 20 equal to 30. Now I am incrementing i equal to i plus 1. Now i equal to existing value of i equal to 1 plus 1 equal to 2. So here what happened? Uh, 2 less than 3 is true. I am obtaining input. Now I am giving x equal to 30. Sum equal to sum plus x. What is the existing value of sum? Is 30. Sum equal to existing value sum equal to 30 plus x equal to 30 sum equal to 60. Now I am incrementing i i equal to existing value of i is 2 2 plus 1 equal to 3. Now it will check okay 3 less than 3 is false it is coming out of the loop and average will get calculated. So here okay I will write here average Average equal to sum 60 divided by what is the n? What is the value of n? n equal to 3. 3 equal to 20. So now to print sum and average. So sum 60, average 20 are my output. So in this way, the flowchart works, it works perfectly. So this flowchart is to calculate uh, sum and average of given n numbers. So, given n numbers, uh, sum and average for the given n numbers get calculated. That's it. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel, share, comment and press the bell button. Thank you.